warmed up and ready to go as they will bring us to Portland, Oregon, and your FC Byron TV news team will be right there every step of the way. This scenery. FC Bayern Munich has arrived in New York with style. Thomas, so what are the challenges that Borussia Dortmund have to face this season? I'm sitting outside here waiting for Julian Green, and then I look outside, the man has got his own bus. Well, listen, Julian, we appreciate you taking time out of your busy schedule to let us come on your bus. Thank it's down, man. Thank you. Nice to meet you, bro. Good afternoon and welcome to the FCB TV News. All day. All day. And once again, beautiful run. He's got some room. Jason Simpson. He can't be stopped. He looks like he's going all the way. And back for a long one over the middle. And it is caught. Beautiful pass, aired out by Christian Hackenberg. A lot of good players up there. Demarcus Robinson for the Voodoo is one to watch. And he throws a bomb on the first play. My goodness. For a pick of 38 yards, just like that. The UEFA Champions League second leg match against Atletico Madrid here at the Allianz Arena. Arsene Wenger's Gunners pushed Bayern Munich to the limit. But in the end, the reigning treble winners came out on top in the Emirates Stadium. Byron's home kit for the next season will be red and white. The celebrations commenced. On the first kicker, I tried to switch Japan reverse tail. And then I tried to kick it into a switch 540 nose grab. And then a 540 over the spine. Next is Francis Aurelien Ducroix, a very solid free skier considered a serious contender for the world title this season. Red Bull Cliff Diving World Series 2009. First time that I finished on the podium and it's a great feeling. Really great. See you now, yeah. With the final dive from the winner, the Red Bull Cliff Diving World Series says farewell to the north of Germany. Hey, it's going to be a great game. Until then, see you soon on Auf Wiedersehen.